All right, ladies and gentlemen, to say Melina is pretty is kind of underestimating her. She's quite talented as well. She's intellectual. She's sophisticated. She's cunning in her, in her dance moves. It's kind of a cunning, kind of sleek, futuristic, kind of modern look to her dance moves. She's a great performer. Not only is she pretty, I mean, look at me, I'm very beautiful, but I'm also talented, all right? And I really want to focus on that because you know what? At the end of the day, we all want to feel like we're talented at something. We all want to feel, yes, we have a lot of skills. Yes, we have abilities. Yes, we can do whatever we want as long as we're not harming anyone. So yes, I believe in Melina's beauty is for sure powerful, but you know, the talent that I possess, you don't have to necessarily be beautiful to be talented. But it does help, for sure. But, I mean, remember, talent is something that can't be looked down upon, you know? Talent is really nice to have. It's great to be talented. It's great to have people supporting you and feeling like you are talented. You know, I'm very blessed. I get treated very, very well. Um, you know, little Kim was someone that was treated very, very well. And she kind of had boyfriends that treated her badly. And she took it the plunge to get plastic surgery. And, of course, you know what? It's sad because she's ruined her face. Uh, but she's okay. She's, I mean, it's brave of her to come back and really great of her to have a comeback. So we really love her for that. But, you know, it must have been tough, you know. But she had all this praise, really, from all these people. But she didn't realize how good it was until she changed her face, right? So I'll, I'll never get past the surgery. But I don't think it's something you can dismiss. I think if you need it or you really like, you, if you really have some flaw that you don't like about yourself, then get it. I think it's important that you do. But... If you have a perfect body and face like I feel I do, then I'm not going to get it. You know, for me, it's not something I want and I don't want to spend the money on that. I'd rather buy nice new clothes and nice things. Uh, but yes, so there are some people that are gorgeous that do get plastic surgery. And if they want it, of course they can get it. But I mean, for me, I just think, well, if you're gorgeous, why would you get it? I just don't think it's necessary. But to each their own, right? Some people like it. And some people want to look like Michael Jackson after you had plastic surgery and what is wrong with that really is there anything wrong with that uh if you want to be like that by all means if that's what you like then who you're not harming anyone and you can afford it obviously because you're paying for it then by all means go ahead like that ken doll you know he doesn't look that bad all of his muscles are fake and he's got everything in, inserted into him but he doesn't look that bad at the end of the day i'm sure he's not unhappy you know he's really happy with that look and that's his whole stick, all right? That's what he likes to do, so that's his whole stick. Uh, so um, he just wants to be a Ken doll, and that's what he likes to do. Now, Marco and Melina are both Ken doll and Barbie doll without plastic surgery, so I really feel great about that. But, you know, there's some people that really like the unnatural, and that's fine, you know? If you're like that, then totally get plastic surgery. But I think if you're gorgeous and you feel unattractive because someone's criticizing you, that's not a good reason to get plastic surgery and it, you could ruin your face or you can ruin your body, right? So like look at Tara Reid. She had a bot surgery and unfortunately she looks, she looked really, really good. I love Tara Reid and I still love her, but you know, she's had a major damage to her body and unfortunately it's cost her a lot of roles and it cost her a lot of problems. I'm sure with her self-esteem, but you know, um, uh, she risked it, and of course, that's what happens when you take a risk. But some people, it turns out really well. You know, Kylie Jenner. I don't think Kylie Jenner would be anything right now without the plastic surgery. I think she's so beautiful now, and she's had plastic surgery to look that way. Before the plastic surgery, I think she was a complete. She would have been ended up being not nearly as rich. She was totally plain, and, and some people liked it. Of course, of course, she was beautiful to some people. But I love her lips now. They're very, very nice. So sometimes it works out for the benefits, all right? Not everyone gets uh, that result, but she did, and she's very happy. So anyway, thank you so much for watching my channel. Love performing for you guys. And remember, um, I'm going to be performing tomorrow as well. And just so you know, there was one thing I was going to say. Oh, come on, I think I forgot. Uh, the one thing I was going to say. Okay, I think I forgot. All right, sorry, guys. Had to end on that. You know what? I'll end on a positive note. So Marco and Melina are both Ken and Barbie. All right, thank you. That's the positive note. All right, thank you. Bye now.